My name is Ryder Chatterbuck. I go to Assiniboine Community College and I am taking power engineering. Into school I got an email about uh, the men's curling team that they were looking for people and I honestly didn't even know it existed until then. So they were just, they just sent out a mass email to everyone in the school. They were looking for a couple more players and I figured I'd fit in. I've been curling for quite a while and I just figured I'd go try it out and see what I thought of it. This is the Brandon Curling Club and this is where we practice. Being a student athlete doesn't have a big impact on me. I try and keep everything pretty light. I just try and think of it like I'm going out playing with my friends whenever I'm curling. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry dude, I work. And then what happened the other four week, two weeks you missed? When was that? You missed the last four weeks. No. Yes. Hit and roll out would be actually good there. Y'all think this? No, it's me. I'm just, I'm just oh, looking. Okay, I'm just uh, looking. Give me normal. It's not feel. It's not feel. You feel it. Add big roll there. Big roll. Hey, that's a perfect shot. My name is Maureen Bonner. I am the coach of the Assiniboine Community College men's and women's curling teams. Well, he came out for a tryout uh, in early September, and um, when I saw, I went through his delivery, he yeah. was yeah, really good. Yeah, it's a um, He had all the aspects of a promising curler, and he also had some background in uh, more advanced curling, way. which a was a real big asset for the, the club. In the program, really the only hands-on experience you get is while you're at your practicum. Other than that, while you're in class, it's just you're in your books, you're going through all of that material. Uh, the books are geared to kind of just for you to teach yourself all of the stuff. So when we go through our assignments at home, where the whole idea of the assignments is to get you to go open your book and just read through all of that and get used to the material that's in there. Going to nationals is a really cool experience. I'm, I'm not super worried about how the games go right now. I'm kind of just going for the experience to go have fun out there, just see some stuff I haven't seen, meet some new people. Okay, so I'm just imagining there's going to be lots going on there. Uh, going to the national championship and meeting other curlers uh, from across Canada, and I've also said this to yeah. every single um, person on our team is that meet them, find out where they live, have a conversation wow, man, with them, create a small relationship because you don't know where your your role or your job or your career is going to send you and you may run into them later on and create a, a relationship where you might be curling again. So it could go full circle.